hey guys welcome back to my channel so um yesterday you would have seen my video showing you an elf haul that i did in the store um so we were supposed to go to edmonton but um we changed our mind because what happened is my fiance was going to get some stuff online on a site called Kijiji. It's mostly like tools. It's like a, a Craigslist where people uh, buy and sell new and used stuff. And um, yeah, he was going to get something on there. So he emailed a seller uh, telling them that he would be in Edmonton on this day. And um, he never got a response from them even up to the day that we wanted to go there nobody replied to him so we ended up going to Grand Prairie which is like two and a half to three hours from where we live um, my mom and we took my mom there when she came to visit and we did a little bit of shopping it doesn't have a big mall it's one floor and that's it but I ended up going there like an hour before they close because they close at six o'clock even during the week so i just had an hour and i didn't have a lot of time to look around in the stores and um i ended up going to a bigger store the last because i know i would take up a lot of time in there it's called shoppers drug mart it's a pharmacy but they sell makeup stuff and things like that so it's not only a pharmacy uh, my mom and I did go there and um, she bought a makeup organizer for my sister. They had them on sale and yeah, so I went back there and then it was after six and they closed all the doors to the mall so I couldn't get back into the mall. I had to exit through Shoppers Drug Mart's uh, door which leads into the parking lot. So, um, so yeah. So I didn't have much time to walk around, but I did get to go to the stores that I like best. And um, I did go into, there is no Pandora store. There is a jewelry store and there is like a small section set up for Pandora stuff. And they didn't have the limited edition charm that I wanted to get. My fiance was going to get it for me online, but it was sold out. So I thought maybe this store would have it, but um, they didn't. It was sold out. They have a new limited edition one, which I didn't quite like as much. So I didn't buy any. Um, so yeah, and there is no Sephora store, which is a bummer. But what can you do, right? So um, yeah, but if I had gone to Edmonton, I would have bought a lot of stuff. Because there's a lot of stores in there that I really like. But I did, however, do some shopping and it's still in my bag. I didn't even empty my bag when I came home. This is actually my favorite one to go shopping with because it holds a lot of stuff. And I can even put my camera in there as well. But we may go to Edmonton another time. We will see what happens. So I'm going to show you what I have in this bag. And... Um, yeah so I'll show you there's a store called Ardeen in the mall and it's a really nice store they sell a lot of uh, like clothes for young people and uh, costume jewelry and stuff like that so um, they have a lot of statement necklaces right now and they're on sale and I got three for 15 and they're the regular price I will also tell you so the regular price on this one was $24 and this is what it looks like it is super windy today guys I'm filming in the living room and I can see out my windows the lake is just rough all the waves are coming up on the docks and the boat lift somebody's boat went away they had to pull it in and put it in the, in the weeds and some of it is breaking away because it's so rough out there so i don't know 
what they're gonna do they're probably gonna try and fix it but it's really super windy and it started from since yesterday and around five o'clock this morning um there was thunder lightning and then it started to rain so i don't know we'll see so yeah this one here is i'm not a big lover of statement necklaces but sometimes they go really nice like you can wear it with a nice turtleneck in in the winter time that'll look really nice or if you've got like a, a top with a cowl neck or even how this one is low in the front for me i can wear a nice statement necklace with that so wherever you've got skin showing on the front you can put it on there and yeah I, I like this one it's pretty it kind of reminds me of those like egyptian princesses kind of thing and it's so super cute and it was regular 24 dollars when the cashier told me how much i saved i was like so surprised so that's the first one i got and the next one this one was 18 dollars another pretty one super cute this will look good with something black super nice and the last one is this nice one how cute is that that's so cute i love it this one is was 18 dollars as well so yeah my mom and i we were in there and i looked around and i thought they were kind of pricey so i didn't buy any at the time but then they were three for 15 so i said well it's always good to have a nice a necklace can show up something that's plain looking like if you wear a, a plain black dress or something you can always dress it up with accessories i always think the accessories is what shows an outfit up most so that's all you really need a big necklace and you're good to go so i ended up saving 45 dollars i was so surprised at that when she told me i was like what really but you know they were a good buy so good to have yeah so uh, then i went into a store called uh, winners I don't know if they have them in the states but they sell a lot of unique looking things for home and i started my christmas shopping so i bought something as i see it i said well i'll just grab this because you know i don't know when i'll come back there i mean they have them in edmonton but you know i don't know if we'll even go to edmonton so i'll have to wait and see so it's called winners and they sell a lot of designer clothing at a cheap price but you need to have a lot of time to go through the rocks and i did when i first came to canada i used to go and stand there for hours and hours and look through rocks and rocks of clothing now i don't have the patience to do it so i got this for my fiance and i really like how they wrapped it up and it's this uh magnifying glass which needs to be cleaned i thought he would like something like this i had bought him a set with a letter opener and a magnifying glass and it got stolen when we were moving here i don't know if the movers took it or if when we left the stuff here somebody came into the house and took it because there were other things that were missing things i ordered online for the house and we didn't open them because we thought we'll leave it packaged because if we open them we have to wrap it again so we thought we would leave it in the package and then when we come here we would just put it out some of them are gone so i don't know what happened there but anyways this is glass we do have a couple out here but they're plastic so this will be a really nice gift i think hmm, that's funny yeah so this will be really nice i just have to shine it up and uh yeah there will be a stocking stuffer so that's pretty nice 
So I've got a jump start on my Christmas shopping. And if we do go to Edmonton, I will uh, start doing a little bit of shopping as well for Christmas. I don't want to leave it all at the last minute like I did last year. So, yeah. So my shoppers... Uh, Shoppers Drug Mart, where I like the shop, they have a, an online site as well, but they sell only makeup on there and fragrances. And that's where I bought my Ariana Grande perfume from. But we did that in Slave Lake, which is like an hour from here. So I bought it when I went there. But anyways... They had a sale on and I saw a couple things when I was leaving and I just didn't feel like going back to grab it because I was ready to leave the store and my fiance was waiting in the parking lot for me and I didn't want to have him waiting too long. So this is the bag and I got, I've been eyeing this up online for a little while. It's the Jergens Original Beauty Lotion and it's um it's a cherry almond essence so it smells really really good i really love it it actually has a smell like a shampoo but it's gonna be good i think for uh maybe for winter it depends on how thick it is so that's what i got so how much did i pay for this 7.49 for the lotion and then I got the uh, Jergens Shea Beauty Oil it's a body oil after shower apply onto damp body skin and massage thoroughly allow a few seconds to dry so this is this one here pretty nice uh, that one was 7.99 so I they put the dot, this one was on sale, so maybe the other one was regular price. I don't really care because I wanted it anyways. I think this is more expensive where we live, so that's why I grabbed it. So this really smells good. I really like it. It smells like, um, how do you say, chocolates. It's got a really nice smell to it. I think they call the people that own that boat that sailed away there because nobody's really out here now because it's fall well it's not fall but it it's like fall out here already because the leaves are falling they're all yellow and dried up and um, people are doing back to school shopping uh, next weekend or no next monday it's going to be labor day so um, people might probably come out and start bringing in their boats because then it's back to school after that so it will probably start to get pretty quiet in here now and then fall time is we're getting a few days of rain and stuff like that so when it's rainy there isn't much to do out here you can't really go out on your boat and stuff so We'll see what happens, but I like the nice and quiet because then I can take my dog for a walk. Nobody else is bothering us, like driving all the time. You gotta shorten the leash every time somebody comes by and stuff like that. So anyways, this thing is good. I love the smell. You know how I'm into body oils. I really like them a lot. So yeah, and then I picked up a couple pieces of clothing. So, uh, the first one I'm going to show you is this little dress, which is like a little crochet and lace. And they were on sale because they're bringing the fall stuff out already. So, super cute. I paid 20 bucks for this. So, I thought this was pretty nice. You can wear it with even skinny jeans or leggings or whatever you want to wear it with and then I got this one this one was also $20 it's got like a little tie in the neck here and that's the bottom 
the bottom is really pretty I don't know how good you'll be able to see this so it's really super cute I like the colors on it I thought it was nice and then I got this one this one is nice I don't remember how much I paid for this I bought so many things yeah so that's this one and it's got like a little sash to tie in the back of it really cute colors are really super nice it's short but i like it i don't really like short dresses too much but i mean if you're going to like a party or something you want to wear something pretty and then i got this one the crochet on the top it's potted in here and that's the colors that's the back and this one was on for 30 bucks half price it was regular 60. i think this is nice for next summer because it's no longer summer it's cool and down here i have to go out wearing a hoodie because it's so cool now so yeah so that was my video and um i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope you're having a good day uh, leave some comments down below if you liked anything that you saw in the video and uh yeah don't forget to like and subscribe guys and uh, have a good day bye